Okay, so for my final major project, I've decided to do an animated music video. I want to, like, I'm inspired by videos such as Clint Eastwood by The Gorillas, because that's like one of the first music videos that was like heavily animated and well, did well. And also Daft Punk made a chain of music videos that like had a continuous storyline, so it was literally like a mini film series, which I really liked. Um, and I've also considered that like the different styles make for a very different outcome, such as those music videos. Why I chose it is because I quite like the animation aspect, but it also ties in my like interest in music. So it kind of just worked for me. Um, and it links into like advertisement, which I'm also interested in, so it kind of drives me to do it. The equipment that I need is quite extensive as it's all computer based. So like down to the software, which is Adobe After Effects Animate. And also I heavily rely on being in a Mac suite using a drawing pad, which I've never used before. Um, there's a lot of decisions that I've got to do. For example, I don't think it's right for me to choose the music that I use, because it, that basically decides the audience. So, for example, dance, it would be like a much more upbeat video, whereas if I did rock, it would probably be more like eerie and like different. <laughs> Potential problems that I have is that I've got not a lot of animation skills, apart from stuff that I've done earlier in the year. Being able to continue my work at home will be quite limited just because the computers and all that. Not being able to use music due to copyright, which I've looked into, and if I wasn't able to use that, I've looked into other options such as friends making music, which would work anyway. And then YouTube, obviously the copyright issue again, and lessons in the Mac suite are quite limited. But the solutions to that is I have an Adobe account, so I'll send that all my work home and continue it, especially we have a two week gap in the half term. And then research the music options and read the YouTube guidelines to make sure that I'm not working towards it, not being able to publish it. I've made an example of the research that I, because to start my project, I've got to start straight up with research. So music type will be the main decider. I'll do a survey, which I've already done a prototype on, what people would like to see, styles and all that. And then primary research would be like in-depth style and like the length of the video, whereas some secondary research would be reviewing videos of the same style, genre, and then just making a portfolio of what I think would be the best route for me to go. I've done a little chart of how I would present. This is roughly how long I think the individual parts of my project would take. So one week for initial research and the surveys, one to two weeks to research the style and how I think I can present that with my own twist on it. A week for a draft, as I need to get used to all the equipment. Another week for the feedback and the second draft. And then I've left a good chunk of four weeks, which includes part of the half term, to create the project as I kind of want it to be refined and not rushed. So I've given myself plenty of time. And then evaluating, I've decided that I'm gonna use two forms just so I can get everything nice. Weekly reflections, and then all Canva pages as I used that early in the year and it was quite good. And then regular feedback using surveys, which again, I've already tried, and just seeing what people think. And yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> So you don't know what music yet, you're not no, sure? No, I was going to decide that, but then when I was thinking into it, yeah. that would narrow like the audience down so much that I'd want other people to decide that. I like that, I like that, um, because it's giving you an extra challenge there. Yeah. But how are you going to decide? So I'm going to, I've, on this, I've put my first three, like three types of music. Are you going to let an audience decide that? Yeah, so I'm going to do a survey, but obviously I'm not going to like, have it too broad, so you know, like country music, like stuff that I am interested in. So you're interested in all three of those? Yeah. yeah that's good. But so we get to genre, Yeah. then how are you going to decide? I'll do another survey, but it's, I won't make it too technical. I'll do like examples of other videos. Yeah. For example, like Arctic Monkeys, 
I think it's Are You Mine. Their music video is a lyric video, but it's heavily animated, which I quite like. Mm -hmm. But then maybe people would want like a character video, so yep. just examples, so it's easy for an audience to decide. Sure, okay. Um, so, like, uh, one thing that interested me was um, the uh, your interest in advertising. Yeah. Um, and I suppose, like, the digital media aspect of advertising. So, um, how's that going to play into uh, your, perhaps, your, like, your reflections and stuff like that? Because at the minute, I've it. seen a lot of adverts, like, especially Apple Music, they're using, like, short animated music videos to promote not only their, like, product of Apple Music, but, like, other songs, which I quite like, because it's just, like, on social media gets out there and it's just somewhere that I can go onwards from if I enjoy this project and if it goes wrong. Yeah. So this is the sort of animation you're doing with Carl, not stop motion or anything No, not like that. stop motion. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. Um, so do you have like do you have certain techniques that you would like to employ? Because we've been able to touch upon animation, yeah. but I fear, like, for example, we haven't touched frame by frame animation yeah. or anything like that. I've looked at a lot of YouTube videos, which, are, like, obviously that's not a lot of research, but, like, just flowing animation, no, like, I don't know how to explain it. Just as if it was just filmed, like, clean. <laughs> okay, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's most probably going to be um, frame by frame. Yeah. Um, one thing you've got to take into account is um, the amount of time you have, yeah. particularly if you're starting out new mm -hmm. into this, um, how much that can be limited and yeah. how much patience you actually have to have. If you're, say, for example, drawing the same image again and again yeah. and again, okay? So um, what will be the final piece? What will we see? Because you said a series of music Yeah, videos. that was my first idea, but then researching into it, it was most likely just going to be one full length music video yeah because I think I wouldn't be able to complete multiple in the time yeah so like a three minute animation yeah. three minutes to four minutes animation is, is doable yeah and but still it's quite difficult most likely like a lyric video but tied into like again with the Arctic Monkeys video it had some like string animation so no like technical stuff if I can avoid it okay okay um, yeah, fair enough. Um, so maybe maybe saving some time by doing some perhaps like experimental sequences and things like that yeah. as opposed to... Um, Jumping straight into that. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so when you were talking about like your schedule, mm. you, you mentioned specifically um, first drafts and second drafts and yeah. things like that, and then a section that was uh, focused on like the full production. Yeah. So, um, what do you mean specifically by a draft? So, like, one of the drafts will be like probably like a stop frame thing, but I put it into maybe Premiere Pro so I can see what it's going to be like. Okay. And then the second draft could be like a part of that animated to see what the final piece would look like. That's fine. So, just yeah, getting into it. That, it's interesting that you mentioned that because that's just generally how animators yeah. work. They produce um, what they call like an animatic or a visual yeah. storyboard. So you've you've hit the nail on the head there. Yeah, that's 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 good. That's fine. I've got no other questions for you. Has anyone else got questions? No. Do you have any idea of what your story will be? If you know, or did you have any idea? I had a few ideas. I put it on my project thing, but okay. a marching person with just like lyrics, because that's basic animation that I could loop. Just easy stuff. Oh, fair enough. Could, All right. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay, all right. Um, thank you very much, Lily. That was, that was fine. Yeah. Who's Lily with? Uh, me. Yeah. Um,